Hi everybody, it's Brad with Big Family Homestead. And in this video, I'm gonna share with you some meals that are awesome, cheap, and feed a large, large crowd. So let's get to it. So our family is a large family. So we're always on the lookout for meals that will feed everybody, that will make everybody happy, that are healthy, not boxed up garbage, and stuff that is affordable. So I'm gonna share with you five, kind of five, of the meals that we currently actually use on our meal plan regularly and fit all of those criteria. So with that said, here we go. Number one homemade buttermilk southern style biscuits and sausage gravy. This meal is awesome, awesome, awesome. I've never met a kid who didn't like a, a nice fresh biscuit out of the oven. It pleases the kids, everybody's happy, and it's cheap, cheap, cheap to make. At only $5.65 to feed a crew of nine. That's our size crew. That is a pretty awesome, tasty, cheap meal. No from a box kind of ingredients. It's all just basic from scratch stuff. Easy to make and pleases the whole crowd. So biscuits and gravy, we salute you. All right, next up, a family favorite, weighing in at $6.60 to feed nine people. Nine people. That is red beans and rice with some grilled chicken. This stuff is delicious. Lots of lots of tropical Spanish flavor. It's uh, really, really a crowd pleaser for us. And the, with the rice, you can really stretch it far. Beans are not that cheap. You make your own sofrito and uh, you're off to the races. This is a winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> Literally, yeah. Next up at only $5.85 to feed a massive crowd is a tortilla soup. Now, we really like tortilla soup on those cold kind of, you know, fall slash winter days. It's easy to do. You're talking cans of corn, cans of tomato. You slap it together. Another thing that's really nice about this specific meal is it takes no time to do this. You literally throw stuff in the pot and heat it up and you're done. The kids like it. The sweetness of the corn really works well. Have some cheddar cheese to throw on there. Toast up some, um, you know, some tortillas so they can dip it. Everybody wins. Great meal. Feeds nine for $5.85. That's pretty awesome. All right, now next up is grilled chicken Caesar salad with fresh, and I mean fresh, artisan bread. Now, the Caesar salad's a no-brainer. Easy to do. Croutons, we add tomatoes, and, and we'll also add, you know, if we have whatever fresh vegetables are in our garden. I didn't put that on there because I'm not assuming that you have a garden, even though you should have a garden. You should. You should. Uh, but we'll throw extra stuff in there. The grilled chicken's awesome. It's, it's a cheap meal, but here's the thing, and I'm gonna put a link, I think maybe over here, over here, I don't know, whatever, to the, an artisan bread recipe that we make. And yes, we make it from scratch. Yes, it's easy. And yes, it really only costs about 40 cents to make this amazing artisan bread. It doesn't take any time. Uh, you literally, well, you watch the video. You come back and if I'm wrong, you complain and blah, blah, blah. I'll give you your money back for the video, how's that? But anyway, the uh, Caesar salad weighing in, awesome family pleaser, good for you. And the artisan bread, fresh bread, amazing, amazing meal for super cheap, baby, yeah. Now, lastly on this list is a recipe that we kind of Frankensteined together from some other things and we call it unstuffed cabbage casserole. And it's basically kind of like a cabbage, well, it's like a cabbage roll, uh, but it, it gets fiddly to make cabbage rolls. You gotta wrap them all up and all the stuff that's in there. I mean, you've got your ground beef and you've got your rice and you've got your cabbage and all the goodies, except we just don't stick it inside in a rolled up piece of cabbage. We just chop the cabbage up and put it in there like that. The kids love it. This stuff stretches a long way because of the cabbage. And when you're talking about $5.75 to feed a massive crew of hungry kiddos, that's a pretty good deal. Pretty healthy, no boxed up chemical nastiness. You guys can do this. Actually, I'd really love to hear some of your recipes. Um, please, in the comments down below, share your recipes for big families with me. I would greatly appreciate it. I love hearing other stuff that we can implement into our arsenal of yummy, delicious goodness. So please pass the video around. Hope you liked it. Like and subscribe if you don't mind. I greatly appreciate that. It does help our family out. I'm Brad with Big Family Homestead, and you have an amazing day.